Hello. Good day. It is Wednesday. And Wednesday, I typically head over to the shop. Not every Wednesday, but most Wednesdays. I go over to the shop. I start my day by doing payroll, spending money. So that is where I'm headed. So the weather in Florida is really gloomy this time of year. Like, um, throughout. God damn, y'all saw that lightning? Um... Yeah, it's about to storm, storm. And yes, I have on my sunglasses because in my car, if you're in the car, the sunglasses are on. The only time that it's not on is at night. Um, you know what I can't stand? When your significant other, your husband, your boo, your, your partner, uses your car and then they change all the settings, but they don't change it back. Like, I'm, I know my seats and stuff are like set up automatic, but... I'm gonna need you guys to start putting the the freaking um, what the mirrors and stuff back to where you found them because it's so annoying. I set them up perfectly, and then I come back in and they're all jacked up. But anyway, um, we're about to head to the shop, get some work done over there uh, because typically. On Wednesdays are like my real admin days for the shop so I go over there I do payroll I see what's going on I figure out if there's any inventory needs you know just kind of poke around and um, get some stuff done if you follow me on Instagram guys you know that for my birthday I wild out I turned up okay and um, we were out on the water and I got such a sunburn and I'm peeling so bad. I've never peeled this bad in my life. And y'all know I'm brown. I'm not like this light skinned person that burns easily. I burned like my full, my forehead looked like a map. It was peeling so bad. My nose was peeling like sheets of skin were coming off my face. And the same thing is like going on on my shoulders, like on my chest. I've got this like heat rash going on and it's been like a week already and um, shit's not getting any better. So I don't know, I don't know what's going on. If you guys know how to treat sunburn and really bad peeling, please let me know in the comments or DM me because I look crazy. Like I'm just glad that it's like not on my face anymore. But um, it's like the rest of my body's peeling and I feel like I just look ashy all the time. And this is not the weather to be wearing like cardigans and sweaters and like jackets. It's hot as hell. Jesus, I don't know what is going on at the Starbucks by my house. But every time I pull in here, the line is like, it's ridiculous. It is definitely not cute. I don't know if they need some more help, but Starbucks gonna need to get it together for me because we got shit to do. And the weather is becoming so bad. Like, look at this. It's so bad. It's so ugly out. You know, it's one of those days where it's like you kind of just want to stay inside. Is my thing dirty? We don't have that luxury, do we? We don't have the luxury of sleeping, of eating, of just getting things and going. We gotta wait in lines and shit. But anyway, so while we're waiting in the line, might as well have a little kiki. You guys have probably noticed I've been fairly quiet on here. This rain is gonna annoy me with the audio. You guys, first of all, I'm still in the Starbucks line. Secondly, the wind just shook my car. Like, I'm literally thinking about just turning around and going back home. This rain is not playing. It is not playing with us today. It was like, we're gonna rain. With no mercy. It looks like a whole storm. Definitely not the weather to be out in, but we've got things to do, man. I can't. I, I can't. I can't. But it's still a good day. It's still a good day. And I'm but I'm still in the Starbucks line. What's what a guan Starbucks? What a guan. 
I've been in this line for like 20 minutes. Is it really that serious? Yeah, yeah it is. Yes it is, it is. What up, fam? You're on the vlog. We're here. The weather is so shit today. Yeah. I know y'all gonna be pissed off if I don't run y'all y'all money. What you mean? Oh, oh yeah, because you only work like half a day. <laughs> a half of a half, a quarter of a day. I'm here and I still have my glasses. I did all of the payroll stuff. I paid the guys and I checked the mail. So um, I got another trademark registration. This one is for pound for pound for pound production. So congratulations to him on his new trademark registration. I got to mail this one out. I just got that in the mail today. So yes, the registrations do come here into the shop. It's just like the safest place to get them outside of my house, but I'm not about to put my home address on the USPTO website, like we're not gonna do that. So anyway, so I have to do inventory because the shop is looking really, really sparse right now. We need like um, vape devices, we need fumes, we need batteries, we need cones, we need hookahs, we need glass, we need tips, we need, <laughs> I said tips, we need a bunch of stuff. So I'm gonna just walk around really quickly, get a quick inventory of things that I need to get um, because I'm gonna have to go shopping this week, obviously, because the shop is looking empty as boot. So yeah. I just finished at the shop and now I have a call scheduled that I have to take so I'm gonna take that call and proceed with the day I'll probably just take it in the car because yeah if this thing will dial out hola what was that Anyway, I am back. I'm home now. Uh, Ethan just got home from camp. My um, my camera died right before I left the shop, and then no, actually no. I was I was talking to you guys when my camera died. So my camera died. I had a couple of um, consultation calls and client calls this afternoon. It's like well into the afternoon. It's like quarter to four now. Ethan's home from camp and I'm about to record a video because I haven't really recorded any like substantial like legal tip videos in a while. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I scripted one out the other day so I'm gonna go ahead and record that. So um, 
I actually have to look a little bit presentable in the videos. I can't get away with looking like a whole homeless person. Like I look like 99% of the time. So I am going to get myself together, put some makeup on, um, shower and stuff, and just like, you know, be all fresh for the video because I feel like when you feel like dressed and you feel fresh, um, <clears throat> I feel like I have some more like more energy for the video. I'm a little bit more energetic and um, and whatnot. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I do not want to be up super late tonight editing or recording um, or doing any work. I kind of want to get some rest because I don't know about you guys, but usually when I get into these zones, like after I've taken a long break and I come back to work, I end up like ODing on work and I end up not eating properly I end up my sleep pattern gets all messed up and that's just a bad bad combination for someone like me who has like anxiety already um because then it'll get this this pattern will start where I'll go to bed super late um and I won't be able to fall asleep till four or five o'clock in the morning and then I'll wake up and I'm dragging the entire next day and then I need a whole bunch of coffee and then the caffeine has me wired and it just starts this slippery slope of every night not being able to sleep and then just staying up thinking about things or staying up and justifying being up till ungodly hours because you're doing work when your ass should really be freaking sleeping and resting. It's just a recipe for disaster. It's never ever served me well so we're just not gonna get on that uh, roller coaster at all. We're just not gonna do it. That's what we're not gonna do um, this summer. I'm gonna make it a point not to do that. But sometimes I can't help it. Anyway, I'm saying all of that to say, I'm gonna go get ready to record this video so I can make sure that I get some work done this evening and make sure I'm in bed at a decent hour. So I'm gonna go get ready now. And I will check in with you after. I mean, I showered or whatever. <laughs> um I'm about to go record this video it is now almost five o'clock it's five to five so I'm running a little bit behind I don't want to spend more than an hour recording this video but I need to eat something because I haven't eaten all day and this is always what happens to me y'all know I'm infamous for that you would think and I always say this you would think I would be like 90 pounds <sighs> I can't open this thing I have sushi here it's like um I don't know what it's called. It's some kind of lobster roll or whatever. But, like, I'm literally going to shove this in my mouth. Uh, oh, my lip gloss. And I'm going to have to come back and eat the rest later. Because we got stuff to do. I always say that. I shut it out. Mm. Coffee. Alright, my hands are full. I'm going to see y'all when I'm recording all right so I am done recording um it took longer than expected obviously because I guess I'm out of practice but my camera would not like stay on focus I got that new 50 millimeter the nifty 50 lens and for whatever reason it just doesn't stay focused you got to put the camera like super far in the room for it to even like I don't know I'm not a videographer so sometimes this shit gets a little bit frustrating Anyways, this coffee, I've been drinking it for like 50 hours. Jesus. Um, so I am going to order dinner now for Ethan and I because his dad is working late. And then probably just going to relax a little bit and then just get some work done. I got a couple of trademark searches to do and some class analysis to do for some clients and okay. send those out tonight. And then let me see. Thank you. Oh my God. Say hi, Daddy. <laughs> Who it is? <laughs> it's a wife. It's your wife. She bad. Mmm. Mmm. It's giving. That's not. That's not. Look at that. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, enough. I'm gonna wow. hit y'all. I'm gonna check in with y'all in a second. Hold on. What do I do with my water? 
In the closet? Oh. No, I didn't. So, yeah, my husband is working late, so me and Ethan are going to figure out our dinner arrangements. I'm probably going to do tacos, even though it's Wednesday. But tacos is never a bad idea. Tacos is always a good idea. So we're going to do that for dinner. And then, <clears throat> like I said, I've got a bunch of... Um, trademark searches to get done i'm gonna get those out tonight because i hate when those things are like hanging on my head because they're not particularly difficult or time consuming if you know what you're doing excuse me she's so she's not even eating your food my dogs always have drama because they eat out of each other's bowls and the little one always gets annoyed at the big one so Stop. So the trademark, the trademark search and the um, class and description analysis, those are not particularly hard to do. It's just that um, you actually have to like sit down and do it. And so I just need to slot out some time. I'm a little like distracted because I haven't really eaten anything all day and it's actually like almost 7.30. So I just need to get some food in my system and just like sit down. And just like chill for a second dang everybody's crazy in my house every single living creature in my house is crazy including the guinea pig including the guinea pig all right good morning guys um it's still pretty gloomy out today i am on my way to get a uh, lymphatic massage, like um, body catavation, and um, what's that thing called? Radio frequency. Because I am a woman of a certain age, and there are things that we need to do to maintain our physique. Oh, you know what? I'm actually going the wrong way. I'm supposed to be going this way. Yeah, so. I'm headed over there now. It's about quarter to 10. Um, didn't really sleep last night, and it's exactly what I was telling you yesterday. Like, once I get into, like, work mode, work mode, it's really hard for me to, like, shut it off. And um, I end up being really anxious and really, like, wired and can't sleep. And I end up just, like, passing out out of exhaustion instead of actually getting, like, restful sleep. And then I sleep like a freaking wild animal. So, yeah, not in the greatest of moods this morning. Didn't want to have coffee right away because that's another issue that I have. I have this really crazy addiction dependency on coffee to get me through my mornings and get me through my day. And I'm working on it with my therapist. Folks, I just finished my massage. Let me tell you something. That was so, oh my God, hold on. Yeah, guys, so I just finished my massage and I'm leaving the place right now. First of all, that massage was, oh my God, so good. Um, it's like one of those like lipo massages and obviously you're not gonna get, you know, all these crazy results you're not gonna lose like freaking 15 pounds or anything you're just literally um getting like the fluid and toxins out of your system and they're um, moving any sort of like bloating <coughs> getting things moving um so your stuff can look snatched and on point and tight and right you know what i'm saying so they did this clay detox thing on my stomach where they wrap my whole stomach in clay and then put like um saran wrap or cling wrap all around it and just kind of like let me sit there and it was like warm and like the spa music was playing and i i fell asleep i was knocked out okay eyebrows are done fleek eyebrows are fleek the fuck all right shut up shut up jaleen
all right y'all so i'm back home would you fuck i look like death um but i'm back home i'm about to start um cracking on some work some computer work i just made myself something to eat um i'm doing the starch solution like a loose version of it but um i try to eat um starch and vegetables at my meals versus a bunch of meat so i have like some japanese sweet potato that's what with cinnamon and maple syrup and i made some brussels sprouts um with like some salt and pepper and some oh i'm getting a call It's literally seven o'clock I just wrapped all my work and billing and stuff for this afternoon I'm gonna go and eat and take a shower I think we're gonna head out to premiere lounge tonight for some hookah I think it's like an R&B Thursday kind of vibe I'm not sure but I just need a break and me and the girls are gonna head out and get some hookah and have a little kiki little girl time so I'm looking forward to that but I might actually need to take a little 30 minute power nap because we tired. We is tired because I'm tired. Anyway. Listen, I don't know why this camera keeps like dying on me or like it keeps, it stop, it keeps like not recording every time I like talk or whatever. Anyway, so like I was saying, um, I feel like having some time out with your friends or family or your significant other or whatever the case may be when you're working like as an entrepreneur or a solopreneur is so important because it helps you to just like keep a balance you know what i'm saying we spend so much time just laser focused on the task at hand or whatever we're doing on the projects we're working on and we like completely forget to have a social life and to like connect with the people that we love you know what i'm saying so um, I make it a point even when I'm tired um, every week to do something even if it's just like coffee or hookah or dinner something like with someone where I'm not talking about work like I mean the topic comes up obviously but you know it's not the whole bulk of the conversation because I cannot talk about trademarks and IP and cannabis every single minute of every single hour of every single freaking day I will literally lose my mind and my hair and my youth you know what i'm saying anyway i will catch up with y'all when we get to premiere and i get a hookah because lord knows i deserve it i deserve it stop recording now oh now now you want to record good morning my lovelies Last night was a long one and I kind of regret it because I got a very late start to my day today and um, I had shit to do like early in the morning, me and the hubby, but we never did it because I was sleeping, but um, I'm about to activate again. I'm going to, I'm at Starbucks, you know the drill. And we're gonna do some distro runs today. I was gonna go to two distributors today, but I don't, I don't have enough time. So we're gonna hit up the main one to get like the main stuff that I'm looking for and um, drop it off at the shop. And and then we have to get everything organized for Ethan's birthday party tomorrow. My little baby's turning six. Um, so I've got to do all the goodie bags and um, did we get the green plates? I asked you 
you to get them? The call the place. Did you call the place about the? Yeah, but I told you they, they didn't. All right, so then I have to go to Party City. Um, because some people in this car didn't understand the assignment, so. Alright, so all the runs are done. I'm back home. We just cleaned up the guinea pig's cage. Um, <clears throat> I got a little computer work to do. I gotta send out some engagements and do send out um, a clearance search result to a new client. And um, as soon as I'm done with that, I have to start prepping for Ethan's party tomorrow. I look like a homeless person. But um, yeah, I have to start prepping for Ethan's party tomorrow. I got him, he's having a Minecraft theme party, which is so cute to me. These little boys, like all, whose kids are into Roblox? I don't know if your kids, your kids are, excuse me. If they are Roblox and Minecraft, just let me know in the comments because that's all he wants to do. So we figured we'd have a Minecraft themed party for him. It's so cute, all the party favors and the little bags. I'm gonna show you guys later when I, uh, when I, do the goodie bags or whatever but yeah i'm gonna get some work done real quick probably like a good 30 minutes worth i say that and then it turns into like two hours but no i'm seriously i'm gonna limit it to like 30 minutes and then i'll do my mom duties and then i need to sit down for a little bit because i've had a headache all day and i just had a slurpee and i'm sure that didn't help with all that sugar but i just really wanted it It's party time! Hi guys, it's Saturday morning. Oh no, Saturday afternoon, and we're getting ready for the party. It's my birthday. <laughs> it's Ethan's birthday, so we've got the balloons ready. And um, the cake. The cake is so cute. I'm going to show you guys um, at the party. It's Kit Kat cake, so it's like Kit Kat and M&Ms all around it. It's so cute. I'm going to show you guys once I set it up, but it's so cute. Um, so yeah, we're just organizing. We're gonna get into the car, get everything, head over the trampoline park, and it's gonna be a busy afternoon full of sugar and children and activities. So the fun never ends. So it's about 1.15 in the morning. We had a blast today at Ethan's party. If you watched my Instagram story um, today, then um, over the weekend you would have seen how much fun we actually had. It was a really good time. Um, and then after I went to my brother's and we had dinner and just kind of hung out together, it was really cute. So I got home, took a shower, and I'm about to hit the hay i am tired like i can barely keep my eyes open so anyway that's the end of this vlog hope you guys liked it hope you enjoyed it got something from it um get to know me a little bit more and i will catch you on the next one i'm planning to do these weekly if i can in addition to my regular videos so anyways guys be safe and i'll see you on the next one